If you want to build a new PC for 1440p gaming, then you came to the right place. I show you specific PC build recommendations to play at 1440p resolution smoothly for every budget. I will also show you how each PC performs at 1440p, so if you want to buy one of these gaming PCs, you will find the links down below in the video description with the latest pricing and availability in your region. My name is Valentino, that being said, let's start. With the first PC we have the cheapest one on the list and this is a very solid 1440p gaming system. Here you get the Ryzen 5 7600 which is one of the best value gaming CPUs in the entire market and with this CPU you can play esports games like Valorant or Fortnite at 240 plus on average so feel free to go with a 1440p 240hz monitor. Then alongside this CPU you get one of the only options that you can get in terms of graphics cards in the Intel Arc B580. This is one of the latest graphics cards from Intel and it has 12 gigs of VRAM and it's amazing for 1440p resolution gaming. You can actually play high demanding games at 1440p with very very decent frame rates and the price compared to other graphics cards at the moment is actually pretty decent and if you play at 1080p right now you can expect even higher frame rates. Here you also get 32 gigs of DDR5 memory which is amazing for streaming and content creation. Then you get an aftermarket CPU cooler with RGB, you get Wi-Fi included inside of the system as well, then you get plenty of airflow in the case and a premium quality power supply for this type of build. The total price by the time of filming is around 9 with USD, which makes it the cheapest PC for 1440p resolution if you want smooth frame rates. If you have more money to spend, I recommend you upgrading the graphics card to the RX 7800 XT. This is a very nice graphics card for 1440p, and you can expect over 90 FPS on average, high to ultra settings in high demanding games. For esports games, you can also expect 240 plus FPS on average in competitive settings in most esports shooters, and in very easy to run games like like CS2 or Valorant, you can expect more than 300 FPS, so feel free to go with a 360Hz monitor if you desire to. With this system, you get the same Ryzen 5 7600 because, as I said before, this is a very nice value CPU, and then you get a different case with more print style fans, so plenty of airflow, and you get a better quality power supply. The total price for this system by the time of filming is under 1200 USD, which in my opinion makes it the best mid range 1440p gaming PC that you can build right now. And then if you have more money to spend and you want a high-end 1440p system, I recommend you getting the next one with the Ryzen 7 9700X, which is one of the latest CPUs from AMD and it's actually a pretty nice A-core processor. This CPU is not only great for gaming, but it's also amazing when it comes to content creation and productivity work so if you're a content creator this 9700x is going to be an amazing option then alongside the cpu we have the latest nvidia geforce rtx 5070 ti i have tested this graphics card myself and you can expect well over 130 plus fps on average when it comes to high to ultra settings in high demanding games and also you can easily play games at 4k resolution so if down the line you want to play at 4k this graphics card is actually pretty solid. Here you get a more premium quality motherboard with Wi-Fi included as well. You get a bigger aftermarket CPU cooler to run alongside this Ryzen 7 processor. Then of course you get 32 gigs of DDR5 memory. Here you also get 2 terabytes of SSD which is plenty of storage not only to install a bunch of games but also in case you want to do content creation or if you need heavy files in your computer. Then you get a more premium quality case and a 750 watt power supply. The total price for this system is around $1,800, which is quite expensive, but in my opinion, it's a very high-end computer if you want to play at 1440p high to ultra settings. One thing I forgot to mention is that the 5070 Ti is amazing when it comes to ray tracing performance, so if you want to play with ray tracing enabled, this is going to be an amazing option for you as well, or if you want to use DLSS, the upscaler technology from Nvidia, because it works amazingly well. And then if you want the best of the best for 1440p, 
I recommend you getting the next system, which is the most expensive on the list, but it's also the fastest because you get the Ryzen 7 9800X 3D, which is the fastest CPU for gaming in the entire market. It's also very fast for content creation and productivity work, but for gaming, it's going to be very, very fast, especially in high CPU demanding games like Howard's Legacy or in games like Fly Simulator. If you want to play esports shooters, again, like Fortnite or Valorant or these type of games, you can expect the highest frame rates. So feel free to go with the highest refresh rate monitor because you can basically max out any monitor refresh rate. So you can play at 1440p, 480 plus FPS on average, competitive settings, or even 4K 480 plus FPS, depending on the game and depending on the settings. Then alongside the CPU, you get the same RTX 5070 Ti, because in my opinion, it's one of the fastest graphics cards for 1440p resolution gaming. And here you get an aftermarket liquid cooler, which is going to be even better for the CPU temps. Then you get the Monte King 65 Pro for the case, which is, in my opinion, one of the best looking cases in the entire market and then of course you get a 2 terabyte gem 4 ssd 32 gigs of ram wi-fi included with your motherboard and then an 850 watt power supply which is going to be much needed for this gaming pc the total price will be around 2050 bucks so it's the most expensive system in this list but if you want to max out 1440p resolution or maybe upgrade to 4k down the line i do believe that this is going to be the fastest pc that you can get right now so if you have around 2000 usd to spend and you want to be build a new PC right now, this is going to be the best option for you. Remember that the prices might be different when you're watching this video, so I highly recommend you checking the links down below in the video description for the latest pricing and availability in your region. Thank you guys for watching, thank you for the support, and I will see you on the next one.